Okay, this is actually a special treat for me. I get to interview my good friend, Clark Bartram and mentor. Uh, I've been trying to follow the dust up the mountain, following his trail. Um, he has been on a cover of over 100 magazines. I mean, this guy is like my hero. Clark, tell us, how is your expo and, and what have you done to, to keep your physique? Um, he's actually just on the cover of Iron Man with his daughter. And um, how old are you and, and what are you doing to, to keep in shape, man? Brother, I got to tell you, I am so proud of you, first of all. I mean, we're standing in front of David Kimberly's muscle and fitness cover, and I'm predicting right here today at the 2009 Mr. Olympia that this guy is going to be the next big thing in the fitness industry. He already is coming up. You can see from the way the guy looks in his physique that he's to be reckoned with. He is honestly someone that can take over this industry because, and I know you asked about me, but I really want to talk about him for a minute because I've been doing this a long time and I don't need to be promoted necessarily. But when I recognize talent, I really want to make sure that people understand that the talent is worthy of the exposure that it's getting. And David Kimberly honestly is that person, LA Muscle TV watchers. But this is going to be one of many that he has. So anyway, to answer your question, the expo has been great. I've been working hard. I'm losing my voice. As you can hear, I'm with SciFit now. I'm the spokesperson. Even at 46, I'm still getting contracts. So I wrote the book. I teach people how to do this. But the bottom line is I want to help people that are really good. This guy's got a great physique, got a great look. Expo's been great. Uh, a lot of people coming around. They're loving our products. And I'm just having a great time. And like you said, my biggest accomplishment to date is the cover I'm on this month of Iron Man magazine with my 18-year-old daughter, Taylor who is a gorgeous girl, you know her, and I'm going to tell you right now on this interview that she's got a crush on you, big time. Every time David comes to the house, my 18-year-old daughter's like, oh my God, oh my God, he's so good looking. I'm like, but he's an old guy, you know, I mean, you know, he's too old, just chill. So, yeah, she wanted me to tell you that. That is a very nice compliment, and thank you for doing it on public TV. <laughs> um, Clark, if you were to give some advice to any of the younger guys that are sitting, sitting at home watching this wondering, how do I duplicate their success? How do I how do I become a Clark Bartram? How do I remain Clark Bartram through the years and not lose myself? What would, what would be some of those advice you give them? The first thing you want to do is be humble, and, and being humble covers a multitude of things. To be successful and be humble means don't think that the world owes you anything. Just because you look like this doesn't mean that this is going to come knocking on your door. It doesn't happen. Occasionally it might, but typically it won't. So you've got to work hard. If you've got what it takes, if your mom thinks you're beautiful and fit and good looking and all that stuff, then you've got to work these shows. You've got to be active, just like you're doing. You've got to find a mentor, someone to cling on to and get all of the advice and information that you need in order to be successful in this industry. Because as you can see, and you've probably interviewed a lot of them, there's a lot of good looking people. But there are a lot of stupid good looking people. Yeah, I said it right here. There are a lot of stupid good looking people that don't understand how to market themselves. And that's what I do. I teach people that you are a commodity. You are to be bought and sold and rented. And if the next thing comes along is better than you, you're out of work. So what makes you good is your attitude, it's your humility, and it's the approach you take. And you've got to be in shape all the time. I'm 46. When I was 26, I did an interview just like this. 20 years ago, and I'm still the same as I was then. So in a nugget, that's it right there. Those words are words to listen to. Thank you very much for your time, Clark. My pleasure, and it's great to be here on LA Muscle TV, the only place to see how to get fit, buff, and noticed. He's good. See, I love this guy.